how do you get people to actually adopt collaboration tools? Make it simple. Make it fun. <laughs> fun and easy. <laughs> I think you got to build for users, right? Put users first and they will come. Too many times people expect it that they, they will build it and they will come, but no, you need to talk to the end users, find out what they want, and then build it that way. If you don't understand what they need and what will make them successful, that you can sell that tool. Starting with a small group of users who have a defined or specific reason to use the tool and allowing that tool to kind of see success or that group see success with the tool, even if that's five or six people. And then virally those success stories will kind of spread throughout the organization and that kind of builds. Does it have a mobile client? If it doesn't, uh, how do I access it when I'm on the road? If you can take them off of 50 distribution lists that clutter their email inbox and put that in a social environment where they decide when they want to go look at those things, that's a huge win. Don't assume that you know more than your employees. If it's a good piece of software, put it in front of them, and if they use it, then your employees are smarter than you are. Content, you have to have good content that people are going to come back to and they're going to read and be interested in on a regular basis. Be an evangelist, right? Start using collaboration tools on your own, and then once they see the productivity gains that you're getting by using it, they'll start using it too. Trying to gamify it somehow, give them some sort of a reward so that they can actually have a, an achievable goal. Rewards. What I learned today about gamification is that people respond psychologically to a reward scheme. Increasing rank, earning points, things that video games have taught us. Get senior executive support. Make sure that the executive team is also leveraging the tools and the platforms themselves. You really have to have a purpose, you really have to think through your uh, use cases, and you really have to make sure you have executive support uh, to be able to align and, and rally people around this. You need everyone from C-level management down to every last employee to find value. Make it useful for what their business purpose is. Collaboration for collaboration's sake does not work. It is to make it part of their workflow. Make it some way it helps them get their job done better. People don't have time to spend on stuff that is peripheral. It has to be core. I think making it part of uh, the overall work schedule every day, um, not make it a separate system. Everybody uses the expense reporting system in their company. There's you know 100% adoption. There's nobody not using it. So same thing has to happen with the collaboration tools. Make it part of what they need to get their job done, and then you don't have an adoption issue. Integrate it into the culture of the organization. Um, companies that it's looked at as a hobby or uh, not a, a real initiative of the company usually don't get good adoption. So what's your number one tip to actually get people to adopt collaboration tools. Free candy, 